Good morning students. Let us begin lesson 3.2 the kite festival. Last week we all celebrated Makar Sankranti and most of you must have enjoyed flying kites. So let us explore about kite flying and kite festival in this lesson. To begin with I wish to share a quote. Enjoyment is an incredible energizer to human spirit. Enjoyment is an incredible energizer to human spirit. So energize, energize yourself with the fun. Uh, let us uh, know about the lesson. This is an informative lesson that takes into the fun filled experience of kite flying. Kite festival occupies an important position in Indian culture and it takes place during Makar Sankranti in the month of January. The lesson gives us some information about kite flying and kite festival. Uh, Uttarayan is one of the biggest festivals celebrated in India. It is also known as the festival of kites. Uttarayan is mainly celebrated throughout Gujarat but also in Telangana and Rajasthan. The main event that is the International Kite Festival is hosted in Ahmedabad and attracts participants and spectators from all over the globe. Um, throughout the festival week, the markets are flooded with kite sellers. Patang Bazaar is the most famous market. It remains open 24 hours a day throughout the week. Sardar Patel Stadium and the Police Stadium are the places where this festival is organized. Most of the visitors are from around India, but there are many international tourists, especially from Japan, China, Malaysia, the UK and France. Let us begin the warming up activity. In this, we are supposed to cut the round kite. So we have three categories. One is about nouns, the second one is verbs and the third one is adjectives. So the kite which does not belong to the, this category will be crossed out. So in the first one, festival, celebration, tradition and competition, all the four are nouns. So we we'll need not cross any of the kite in the second one. Uh, uh, verbs, festivity, celebrate, trade and compete. Here celebrate, trade and compete are verbs and festivity is not a verb. So we will cross out the kite festivity. In the next one uh, adjectives, uh, festive, celebrity, traditional and compare. Here festive and traditional are adjectives and celebrity and compare do not belong to this category. So we will cross out celebrity and compare. Children this activity is to be done by you. Uh, name the festival that you enjoy the most of all. Fill in the facts about that festival. Select any festival that we celebrate round the year. Write the name of the festival. Then write when it is celebrated. Then write why it is celebrated. Then you can describe how it is celebrated. Then you can write about the special cuisine that is uh, cooked or prepared on that particular festival. And uh, mention other special features about the festival. So do it on your own and uh, in the, we shall stop in this video over here and we shall commence the lesson explanation in the next video.